What's up, everybody? It's Gas Bandit back again here to talk to you about a game called Road Redemption. Currently in early access, Road Redemption is a motorcycle combat racing game that those of you with old school cred will recognize as being a spiritual successor to a game from the 90s called Road Rash. You and your trusty bike are pitted against a dozen or so rival bikers, and it's a no-holds-barred free-for-all to see who gets to the finish line first. The race courses, however, are on highways that are in current use with lots of civilian traffic, though usually they're more of a danger to you than you are to them. You've got to bob and weave between the slower-moving cars to make it to where you need to go, all the while using a wide and varied array of weapons, both melee and ranged, to fight off your equally aggressive rivals. The game's still in early access, so the visuals do have some rough patches. It looks unfinished in a lot of places. Some of the models and ragdolling are comically outdated. And of course, there's quite a few glitches and bugs that still need to be ironed out. But even with that being the case, this game is some of the most fun I've had in ages. There may only be three basic game modes, those being time trial, rival elimination, and racing, but it's very replayable, with a variety of environments and maps as well as a progression mechanic where you spend XP when you die to earn permanent improvements to your character. And you're going to need those improvements. This game is tough. Unforgiving is the word. A lot of racing games will have your rivals speed up when they're behind you and slow down when they're in front of you to try to artificially produce a more exciting neck-and-neck -neck situation. But not this game. The AI is in it to win it, and it's extremely possible for you to make a simple mistake right at the start of a race that you will never recover from. And that can be frustrating, but this also means that when you do win, it is all the sweeter, because you know you had the training wheels off, and the game wasn't pulling any punches just to shelter your ego. Even now, the game is worth a cost to pick it up. I can hardly wait for them to finish the online multiplayer, but in the meantime, I'm having a blast even on my own. My rating for Road Redemption is definitely an enthusiastic buy. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.